Are we really getting closer to discovering a new planet within our solar system? Planet 9 is a hypothetical ninth planet believed to exist in the far reaches of our cosmic neighborhood. This research is interesting because finding a new planet isn't just about adding another planet to our solar system. It will change everything we know about the solar system and its evolution. In this video, we'll dive deep into the ongoing quest for Planet 9, explore the sophisticated technology aimed at unveiling its secrets, and consider what it means if we find it or if we don't. Without further ado, let's get started. The enigma of Planet Nine continues to captivate astronomers and astrophysicists worldwide. Recent advancements in astronomical research and observational technology have revived the search for this elusive planet. For nearly a decade, the scientific community has scoured the outer reaches without definitive success. However, Fresh data from new studies suggest we are on the verge of a breakthrough. Astronomers Mike Brown and Konstantin Badigin significantly propelled this search when they first introduced the hypothesis of Planet Nine in 2016. Through rigorous calculations and detailed simulations, they observed that several trans-Neptunian objects in the Kuiper Belt, a vast ring of icy debris at the solar system's edge, shared orbital alignments that couldn't be accounted for by any known phenomena. These alignments suggested the influence of a hidden planetary mass, an unknown gravitational force hinting at the presence of a ninth planet. The quest for this planet employs some of the most sophisticated technology in astronomy. Astronomers worldwide use powerful telescopes equipped with advanced optics and imaging technologies to peer into the depths of space. They meticulously analyze data collected from a network of global observatories, including the Pan Stars in Hawaii. Moreover, with the eagerly anticipated Vera C. Rubin Observatory coming online in 2025, researchers are hopeful that its unprecedented survey capabilities will finally spot the elusive Planet Nine. Building on these foundations, recent computer simulations and statistical analyses have refined our predictions about where Planet Nine might be found. These models show how a planet, about 10 times the mass of Earth, and located hundreds of astronomical units away, could exert the gravitational influence necessary to shepherd trans-Neptunian objects into the observed orbits. By correlating these theoretical orbits with the latest observational data, astronomers are narrowing down the search area, bringing us closer than ever to confirming whether Planet Nine is reality or myth. The quest for Planet Nine is not just a modern astronomical endeavor, but a continuation of a legacy that began over three centuries ago with Sir Isaac Newton. Newton's law of universal gravitation has been the cornerstone of planetary discoveries and celestial mechanics. It describes how every mass in the universe attracts every other mass with a force that decreases with the square of the distance between them. This foundational principle helped astronomers first understand and then predict the movements of planets. The story began coincidentally with the sighting of Uranus by William Herschel in 1781, which was initially mistaken for a star or comet. It was Neptune, however, whose discovery in 1846 truly showcased the predictive power of Newtonian mechanics. Deviations in Uranus's orbit, unexplainable by known celestial mechanics, suggested the influence of another unseen body. Leveraging Newton's laws, Urbain Le Verrier and John Couch Adams independently calculated the position of this new planet, leading directly to Neptune's observation. The prediction and subsequent discovery of Neptune was a landmark event, validating Newton's theories on a grand scale. Today, astronomers use these same principles, enhanced by technological advancements in telescope design, digital imaging, and computational models to search for Planet Nine. The techniques have evolved from glass photographic plates to digital sensors, from manual calculations to sophisticated computer simulations, but the underlying physics remains unchanged. The search for Planet Nine involves scanning vast areas of the sky, analyzing the movements of distant objects, and looking for anomalies that could indicate the presence of an unseen massive object. This methodical, data-driven approach requires patience and precision. As the potential planet's orbit is estimated to be highly elongated and tilted compared to the rest of the solar system, 
making it an even harder target. By linking past methodologies with cutting-edge technology, astronomers not only honor the legacy of their predecessors, but also push the boundaries of what's possible in cosmic exploration. The search for Planet Nine opens up more than just the possibility of discovering a new planet. It challenges us to consider what else might be out there if Planet Nine does not exist. The observed gravitational effects leading to the hypothesis of this elusive planet might instead be explained by several compelling alternatives. One possibility is that a cluster of smaller bodies, not just one large planet, could be exerting the observed gravitational influences. This cluster, potentially made up of many small, icy objects beyond Neptune, could collectively mimic the gravitational pull of a single massive planet. This scenario would suggest a more populated and dynamically complex outer solar system than previously thought. Another intriguing theory is the presence of a significant accumulation of trans-Neptunian objects in a specific area of the Kuiper Belt. This dense collection of matter could create localized gravitational effects strong enough to influence the orbits of distant objects like Sedna and 2012 VP113. Such a discovery would not only negate the need for a Planet 9, but also highlight the intricate gravitational interactions that govern the solar system's frontier. Lastly, the anomalies might signal the need for new physics. Some researchers propose that the unusual orbital paths of these distant objects could indicate limitations in our current understanding of gravity, perhaps pointing toward modifications of Newton's laws or general relativity. This radical proposition opens up exciting possibilities for theoretical physics, suggesting that our exploration of the outer solar system could lead to revolutionary changes in how we understand forces and motion on a cosmic scale. Each of these scenarios provides a rich field for scientific inquiry, offering different insights into the nature of our solar system. Whether or not Planet Nine exists, the search is valuable. It pushes the limits of our knowledge and technology, challenges our theories, and ultimately enriches our comprehension of the universe. Thank you for joining us on this fascinating journey through space and time in search of Planet Nine. As we continue to probe the outer reaches of our celestial neighborhood, we remain open to whatever truths await discovery, ready to adjust our frameworks and expand our cosmic horizons.